हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स आज हम क्लास नाइन्थ वाटर सिक्योरिटी वर्कबुक में से यूनिट नंबर वन का चैप्टर नंबर टू रिवर सिस्टम के क्वेश्चंस सॉल्व करेंगे सो लेट स्टार्ट क्लास नाइन्थ वाटर सिक्योरिटी यूनिट वन चैप्टर नंबर टू रिवर सिस्टम क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स नेम ऑफ द एक्टिविटी टू प्रिपेयर अ मैप ऑफ द रिवर सिस्टम इन योर डिस्ट्रिक्ट Purpose importance of the activity. This activity aims to create a detailed map of the river system in our district. Understanding our local river system is vital for various reasons, including flood management, water resource planning, and environmental conservation. It helps us appreciate the significance of rivers in our region. Proposed time duration for the activity. approximately to 2 3 weeks materials and apparatus required for the activity one large maps or chart paper two markers colored pencils and other drawing materials three reference maps of the district four access to a computer with internet connectivity 5 notebooks and research materials methodology of the activity 1 begin by studying existing maps of the district to identify major rivers and their tributaries 2 Divide the district into smaller sections for detailed mapping. Three. Gather information about river names, sources, lengths, and notable features. Four. Visit local rivers to collect data and observations. Five. Use reference materials and online resources to research historical and environmental aspects. Six. Start drawing the river system on large maps, marking main rivers and tributaries along with key features. Seven. Label each river and tributary accurately. Eight. Highlight any dams, bridges, or important landmarks along the rivers. Nine. Collaborate with classmates to cross-verify data and ensure accuracy. Ten. Create a legend explaining the symbols used on the map. Eleven. Present the completed map to the class and discuss the findings. Diagrams photographs of the activity Dear students draw the given diagram Concepts that have become clear during the activity 1 Understanding of local river systems 2 Mapping and cartography skills 3 Appreciation of the role of rivers in the ecosystem Four. The importance of accurate data collection. What new things did you learn? I gained a deep understanding of the river system in our district, including its geography, sources, and the environmental significance of local rivers. This activity also improved my mapping and research skills. Conclusion. Mapping the river system was an enlightening experience that connected classroom learning to our local environment. It underscored the importance of rivers in our district and the need for responsible river management. Write your own opinion experience about the activity. I thoroughly enjoyed this activity as it allowed me to explore and appreciate the natural beauty of our district. It was fascinating to see how rivers connect various parts of our region 
and the hands-on mapping experience made learning about our local geography engaging. Cooperation from the parents Parents were supportive throughout the project, providing transportation for river visits and assisting with research. Opinion of the parents Parents appreciated the practical nature of the activity and its educational value. They were pleased to see their child actively engaged in learning about the local environment. Persons who have helped you My geography teacher provided guidance and assistance throughout the project. Classmates collaborated on data collection and map creation. Parents supported with transportation and research. Local experts and environmentalists offered insights during field visits. List of the reference materials 1. District maps and atlases 2. Online resources about local rivers and geography 3. Books and articles on river systems and conservation 4. Notes from Geography Class 5. Interviews with local experts and environmentalists 6. Government publications on river management 7. Historical records of the district 8. Survey data from field visits 9. Aerial photographs of the district. 10. Previous student projects on local geography. 11. Topographic maps of the district. Local newspapers and magazines covering river related topics. 12. Information from the district's environmental department. 13. Reports on river pollution and conservation efforts. 14. Satellite imagery of the district. 15. Encyclopedias and reference books on geography and rivers. Great video. Mom. Yes. I found the good channel for study. Great. Like the video. Share it to your school friends. Subscribe to it. But what's the channel's name? Wings of Fire Academy.